was real fast. So uh, we were in our uh, negotiations with our union partners in, uh, in the fall of 2016, and uh, GM knew that we were going to have more truck demand than our current assembly plants could meet. So uh, with a $500 million investment, we decided that Oshawa was going to build pickup trucks where we used to build equinoxes. Everybody knows equinoxes are unibody vehicles, trucks are body on frame, it's significantly different. So we were excited with the opportunity, and then we saw the challenge that we had to do in six months, and we all uh, took a deep breath, and well, we got to work, and in the true Oshawa fashion, the Canyon fashion, we were able to uh, get the plant launched and building trucks on time. We, um, like I say, we spent $500 million doing it, and uh, we had it done in six months. Um, so it's another, another shuttle program too. So similar to the Equinox shuttle with Cami, the bodies for our vehicles are actually made at the truck plant in Fort Wayne, Indiana, and they're delivered um, by over-the-road trucks to us. And we install them in our body shop, do the final body shop work, and then we paint them and run them through our general assembly, and they, uh, they come off the line. It's called a, a bridge program, is to help make sure that we have enough trucks as some of the other truck plants are going through the uh, T1 conversion, so we uh, will keep the, the market fed for trucks. Here in Oshawa, we employ 2,500 employees between the two assembly plants. Our uh, local union is uh, Unifor, Local 222. Greg Moffat is the chairperson and my partner. Him and I work uh, very well together, and there's nothing that we can't do in manufacturing. The two of us put our heads to it. Um, like I said, you're going to see the uh, truck plant today, but you also walk